people generally approach trying to get a job as throwing everything they can onto a reel. So they'll have bits, that, anything they can find, basically. They'll have like, they might do a camera track, they'll try and comp, they'll try and do a 3D model, and everything will be just not that great. And they'll give a reel, and then people will just see that and be like, I don't know what you want to do. So my main advice for people trying to get into the industry is make a very specific reel. So when I got the job at the mill, um, I didn't know anyone in the industry, uh, so I, that's why I went to this course. But I got a job in the mill by making a reel which took me about two days where I got three shots offline, just anything I could find, tracked them, sent them a reel. The next day I had an interview. The, by that night I had the job and was starting on the Monday. So it was kind of like... Because a company, especially larger companies, are after something specific. So they're after a match move or a road to artist. Generally, if you're like starting in 3D, they'll go for match move. Starting in 2D, you'll be doing roto. So if you make a roto specific reel and can show that you can do that, then that's what they're hiring. And they know they can just slot you in and get on with it. Um, once you've developed, if you want to be a generalist, so I'm quite a generalist, I like doing a bit of everything. Um, then you can make a generalist reel that will look good. And then you can get generalist work. But... Generally, I'd say, be specific. <laughs>